takes a look at the wonderful world of juice. This week, the Juice Weasel. And now, here's your host, Morty Langston. bring out today's host, the incredible, most amazing guest we've ever had, Juicy J. Cornish. Wow. Wow. wow, Juicy J, that was an incredible feat of strength. Thank you, Gordy. I took my whole family on long trips like this. Well, uh, wow, man, where's your family now, Jay? They're all dead. I outlived them all. That's the beauty of the Juice Weasel. <laughs> and that is... Uh, well, uh, Jim Carrey paying homage to a true legend. He joins us now uh, to talk about one of the great loves of his life and something that uh, has literally saved him. That's right. This is uh, the man himself, Juicy J. How are you? Hi, Jay. How are you? I'm doing great. You guys look good, too. You, you know? don't Thank you. age. It's, yeah, well, it's I do crazy. age. It, it catches up to you, you know. <laughs> I, from all the football that I played when I was your age. Yeah, we were I talking about those knee replacements, knee USC, places, Green yeah. Bay Packers. But I, I want to quickly talk just to refresh people's memory about the role uh, that juicing played in your life and 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 literally I mean I'm not kidding it saved your life well um, I was put on by a medical doctor on juices you know I had cancer of the urinary bladder yeah and it was considered fatal yeah, yeah. and uh, I went to dr. Max Gerson that was dr. Albert Schweitzer's personal physician yeah and saved his life kept him he and put he said me on juice. The, yeah, I never knew about juices. Oh, I'd have orange juice once in a while, you know. When I was going to the University of Southern California, yeah. you know, you'd go to a bar and you'd hit a bunny and say, let's go get juiced in there. You know? <laughs> right. Yeah. That kind of juice. Was it apple carrot? Was that apple the special carrot, yeah, that magic was, that, juice? That, that was Gerson's drink. And then you had to take enemas and get your colon cleaned and yeah. all that, you know. But... Uh, Apple carrot was the juice of the day for anybody that had cancer. And you had to do it every two to three hours, a glass of apple carrot juice, apple carrot juice, apple carrot juice, you know? And I'm a guy that likes orange juice, you yeah. know, yeah. but they wouldn't let me do it. No, no, you had you to know, do apple know. carrot. The and whole how carrot. long ago was that? Oh, wow, 40. 1948? 48, that's a long time ago. So, uh, a long time ago. 64 years ago. And, was it and 64? Yeah, yeah, it would have been 64 years ago, I think, if my 49, math is right. Yeah. Yeah. Now, tell us about juice itself, because I mean, with you, obviously your story is amazing, well, but it seems like there's a combo for pretty much everything. Yeah, uh, if you think about if you think about juice itself, when you buy things in cans and bottles, they're all dead. Yeah. I mean, it has to go through a cooker. It's a federal law. Yeah. The juice that you buy in a can or a bottle has been sitting in a warehouse for months and months before the, the supermarket shelf is full of that stuff. And, and it's full of sugar and extra well, stuff. Well, some don't have it, but they do. But what it is, it's sterile. They have to right. run it through a cooker to kill the enzyme, which is a life force. Absolutely, yeah. that's what's happened. So we need the live stuff? You have to make it yourself. If you really want to be healthy, you have to have these nutrients freshly made. Yeah. Your own kitchen sink. Let, let, let me go ahead. Is this, you, let's you yeah, gotta, we're all we plugged, gotta, we plugged in. We're ready in. to roll. We're plugged in. We're good to go. What do we do here? There it is. Let's, let's make a drink out of my favorite that saved my life. Okay. This is Dr. Max Gerson's drink for me. Okay. Like he does, and everybody that, that is stricken with cancer. And I had urinary bladder cancer, yeah. you know? So here's what we're going to do. We're going to put apple. Yeah. Boy, juicing is really complicated, isn't it, Jay? I mean, look at how difficult this is. It's no simple. It's no simple. You know, you know, you know what's tough? What? Broiling a steak and stuff like that, right? And then putting that dead carcass into your body and having the baby body digest it. Then you have that cooked blood in your bloodstream. <laughs> what all that? Well, I just became a vegetarian. Well, let's, let's talk about it. A lot of people get to be vegetarians because of that fact alone, you yeah. know? Well, I, you, I take it you're a vegetarian? Well, I'm a vegetarian now, but I wasn't then. Yeah. You, you got to remember, I played football university in Southern California, played in the Rose Bowl and all yeah, that yeah. stuff, you know? That, that wasn't a vegetarian's no, uh, no, sort no, of free, haven. Free food on the training table every every day after practice, you know? But this is this is what your body does. When you eat the carrot yeah. and the apple and whatever, the body then is going to do to the food what we're doing with this, okay. with this, with this. Let's give some to Mikey yeah. here. Yeah, let, let's try this. Quick, quick, quick. Thank you. Now that, by the way, that's fan. a drink that I was put on, carrot apple juice, when I had my urinary problem. Carrot juice is one of my favorites, oh, too. It's good. It's like, I mean, fabulous. it's just, uh, 
I, I, I told you before we started because I have two young children. Oh, what a... And what, every parent... Here, I'll chop some out. Every parent worries about how their kid eats and do they eat enough, do they have a balanced yeah. diet? Do they eat their fruits and vegetables? Exactly. <laughs> Doing this every day, it's five minutes and all of a sudden you have peace of mind because you know in one glass you can feed them kale, you can feed them beets, you can feed them all these yeah. things that kids would never normally touch. And if it's in juice form, man, they'll just exactly. knock it back. Then when our guys were little, Lynn and I had a chair at the sink. Mm -hmm. The guys would stand on a chair because they were too short. To, to get <laughs> yeah, that's what my kids do yeah, too. Yeah, they're right. both on stand chairs. on a chair and I started, first of all, I put the carrot in and they pushed it down. Yeah. I put the apple in, they'd push it down. And then we'd fill it up and they'd drink it. Man, it's what... Now, we've got some nuts on the table here. And I have never thought uh, to use those. Maybe you can tell us how you can use those in your juice diet. Well, it, it won't come out to a juice juice, but it will take some of the, some of the liquids out of the, out of the, uh, the, the almond, you know? Yeah. Uh, now let's get this cut. And why do we soak the almonds? Is, is that part of the process to, to... Yeah, and you get rid of some of the acids that it has, phytate, phytic acid, and stuff like that. Okay. So, and, and because of the skins and things like that. Yeah, because they're hard to digest in Very in hard to digest, form. yeah. Well, but I do, I, I, I eat handfuls of it almost, almost every day, every other day, whatever, yeah. you know? I'm a great believer in almonds. There's the almond diet, you know, if you ever, if you ever... I'm pretty much on that right now because I'm on a cleanse, so oh, we're really happy to have you here today. That's great, yeah. By the way, can they, can, can that, can that camera see this? Yeah? Yeah, can they show it? Yep, yeah, wait, there wait, you go. There you go. Now, you see the slanted basket? Mm -hmm. I was the one that first designed the pulp ejector. Most juicers had the pulp up against the wall, yeah. like a spin dryer cycle of a washing machine, and the, the juice would collect and thicken up in there. Now, the pulp, and then the juice had to weave its way through there, and you lose so much food value. Yeah. This way, by having a slanted basket, right the moment, yeah, the moment you put the food against through the opening, it hits th these blades, the juice comes through these little teeny slits. The pulp slides up right. the wall and blows out the, the back in a half a turn. And uh, Jay, this has been imitated many times. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nobody, nobody, no, nobody, nobody had a pulp ejector to start with. For instance, I want to tell everybody out there, I want you to know you've never had orange juice. You never have. Never? Never. Why? Because people have taken orange and they take it with a reamer. Here, put this, put this, put this. Apple down here. We're just making we're just making carrot apple juice right now. Let's just keep going. By you know way, what? I'm this... going to tell you that you can meet this man in uh, South Surrey, White Rock area. He is going to be there at Anthony and Sons Organic Food Store on January 17th at uh, 3 and 6 p.m. For more information, you can I go am, eh? to the website that is <laughs> on your no, screen okay. right now. Uh, and Juicy it's good Jake. for the triceps as well, juicing. Oh, yeah. yeah. So you're working out. Oh, yeah. yeah. Going, yeah. Switch arms every that. now and then. Football yeah. <laughs> <laughs> player. I don't want to. <laughs> you keep awesome. that body built we're up. We're going to take let, a break. Let, and when we return, we're going to come back with Jay Burchell. Are we going to turn back? Okay. Then, oh, yeah. then I want to show them how to make oranges. Okay, let's keep going. Not orange water. All right. What I want you to do to do oranges, the, re the real fresh orange juice, is take an orange and I want you to peel it because that peel has an oil in it that's unsplittable by the body. Yeah, all that has to be taken. But in doing so, I want you to save as much of that white pulp as you possibly can. Here, we have some peeled already. Yeah. The pulp, save good. the white. The white has the, the, the flavonoids. It has the things that build the capillaries and blood vessels of the body so you don't have a brain hemorrhage later in life, you know? Can I put it in here? Oh, it's true. <laughs> here, oh, yeah. Right. We're going to keep ju juicing. We'll be back right after here. this.